Well, hello there, friends. How y'all doing today? Yeah, <clears throat> you see it as well as I do. Thought this day would never ever come. <clears throat> Here's cattle and crops. Uh, granted, it's not the full edition. It's uh, just uh, throw it out there and see uh, see what happens, kind of thing. It is kind of buggy. There's a lot of bugs to it. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, my uh, usual uh, recording software would not work with this every time I. Uh, would open cattle and crops with <clears throat> excuse me my regular uh, recording s software it would uh, it would crash on me and as a matter of fact uh, the, the the games crashed I don't know how many times and um, doesn't save saved some of the saved games uh, like this time uh, you see I'm uh, going to refill the uh, slurry uh, tanker um, from uh, the field number three on a mission I was doing and uh, <clears throat> excuse me I got most of the field done but uh, I had to go refill it well this is the fourth time I've refilled the tanker so <laughs> uh, it's not saving the game <clears throat> excuse me so um, we can crash here at any time and uh, I'd never know it anyway uh, <clears throat> <coughs> oh, I'm so sorry. Anyway, uh, game's been up two days now. I've played with it a, quite a bit, or a little bit actually. Um, opens up um, doing missions, and that's that, that's a good way to do do uh, to learn the uh, what to do on the map. I believe it's going to be similar to Seasons on uh, Farm Simulator uh, 17. So. In that regards, uh, I'm not anxious to start playing with it because I don't like seasons, and we all know that. Uh, but this is where you f refill your slurry tanker. This is the place that uh, makes the slurry and blah blah blah. And you f come up here and you hit it and you fill it up, and then you keep going. Uh, there's a lot of mouse clicking that that goes on with this game. Uh, we're here we're back on field three, uh, doing it, uh, laying down the slurry. Um, so yeah, there's, there's a, there's a lot that, uh, that's similar to, to Farm Simulator 17, and there's a lot that's not. Uh, one of the things is you got to have backing that's a little bit more, uh, strategic part of the game. You have to be a little bit more accurate than you did in Farm Sim. So, um, that's, that's one thing to remember. Um, your keys, your binding keys to, uh, say I use my Xbox controller. Um, and the, the, there are no, hardly any keys that are bound to that with the exception of forward and backwards. I'm learning where to assign the keys and what to assign them with. Uh, one of them is uh, if you're on a mission and your mission says drive to the farm, when you can hit one button and the tractor will automatically drive you to that to the farm. Sort of like course play without setting the course play uh, um, uh, option up, of course, play uh, up. Um, it's hard to get the mouse to click during gameplay without hitting the tilde key. Um, and you'll see, I, I'm I'm stopping the the, uh, the, um, the the mission here in the middle. You don't have to finish the mis mission, the, the complete mission to complete it. You don't understand what I'm saying. You don't have to do the whole mission, or like fertilize the field. You don't have to fertilize the whole field to complete the mission. God, how hard was that, Jim? <laughs> um, so yeah, they they start out with missions, and it's a good thing. And like I said, you get to learn the controls and get to know what's going on with the farm and stuff like that. You see over there in the right hand side in the middle, at the bottom right, is the speedometer. The panel up above that is how much is left in the tra the uh, in the uh, trailer, and uh, the panel above that is. I'll show you at the end of the the video what that is. You need the mouse for that. It's the IC controls that you might see on the inside of uh, the tractor on Farm Sim 17, and I re I keep going back to Farm Sim 17 because hey, that's all I got to compare it with. So anyway good little uh, game 
I am not uh, totally satisfied with it as of right yet. Uh, this is the uh, first look beta test sort of thing. Um, like I said, there's a lot of bugs in it. And uh, I'm sure they'll be worked out. The graphically wise, I'm not real impressed with it. I'm, I'm not. Um, but um, we'll see how, how it progresses down the road. Uh, this, this just may be one of those things that, uh, I don't know, this, this seems more like, uh, more like a game than the simulator does. So uh, we'll see. I'm not sure how to expand the map down at the bottom on the left-hand corner. And in the middle, uh, down at the bottom, there is a... Um, slots down there and I had no idea what those slots are for uh, Oprah up in the upper left is your money and all that other kind of good stuff that uh, that you that you know of um, so yeah that's uh, as you see some of the uh, things that are going on within the game itself um, there is a farm uh, let's see what else I, that, that's as far as I've really gotten. Uh, I've done this and I've cultivated a field, which you'll see here in a little bit. Maybe you're already seeing it. I don't know. Um, but uh, yeah, it's. Uh, I don't know. We'll see. Well, I'm gonna let you uh, watch for a little bit, and then I'll I'll get back with you. Okay.
Okay, so now the other mission is done, and now I'm walking around the house, which is one thing you're able to do in this game. Uh, these little yellow circles will are indications of where you're supposed to go. So, yeah, that's um, it's a like I said, it's it's not a bad game, um, but it's just that it's a game so far. A lot of uh, a lot of uh, bugs in it. We'll see how it works out. Um, again, forward and reverse is all I know of as of right this second. Um, new cruise control. There's also cruise control, which I would have would have liked to have known earlier that I assigned to my controller, and uh, it's s you s you set the speed you want to go to with your going forward. And then you hit your 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 uh, your uh, cruise control button. That's how that works. A little bit different, you know. There's no buttons to. I mean, no one, two, or three buttons to push. Um, you can do a lot of mo moonwalking if you'd like. Um, I do a lot of that myself, um, <laughs> only because they have figured out the controller so somewhat. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna go down here and uh, jump in the tractor. And I'm going to show you what the insides look like. Sorry about my screen there. So this is the inside of the tractor. And now we're going to look at what uh, this panel does over here. And if you take your mouse and click on the little orange buttons there. So you see the, the door opening and closing. Uh, open. Um, that's the mirror. The, front, the, the mirror there to, to uh, adjust it. You can adjust the other mirrors also, left and the right mirror, outside mirror. Uh, I open up the back window. So you see that's what the um, that little panel's for. And I think you can minimize it, but I, I was afraid to minimize it and not know how to get it back up again. So I'm going to have to investigate on that a little bit, a little bit more. I could find no uh, material on the internet anywhere on... Uh, uh, on what this and that does, how to play the game. It was more of a, hey, uh, you know, good luck, here we are. Uh, but like I said, I uh, do like the part about uh, the self-driving tractors, vehicles. Um, the one time I did do it, oh, there goes the wipers, that's going to be distracting me. Um, it completely missed the car. It was really cool. It's, the car was going to turn in front of it, so it stopped. It went into the car, it passed, and then made the turn. It was just that was just really cool. It was intuitive that that uh, that was going on. So anyway, cattle and crops finally been out, out finally out, uh, sorta. Um, not sure where it's going to go from here. Hopefully, it's it, it's going to get a lot better. A lot of these bugs are going to be worked out. I had to. I reported to myself last night and. Uh, I didn't play around with it that much today except make this video so um, thanks for watching really do appreciate it um, if you're playing it uh, hope you enjoy it uh, if not uh, let me know in the comments section if you're going to get it or or if you're going to uh, play it or if you have played it and you like it or you dislike it okay talk to you later guys we'll see you later see ya